Today, the 18th of December 2022, the MDC Congress is ongoing. And um, as per the norm, uh, MDC T Congress is used to attract uh, 4,500 delegates at least. But uh, this time around, the City Sports Center is um, empty and um, almost 1,000 delegates have uh, so far reported for for the Congress. So Douglas Monzora is uncontested as well as the Vice President is uncontested as the Chairmanship um, seat is also uncontested. So interesting moments, interesting times ahead and um, this is something very important for the people of Zimbabwe to actually take not off. So we are going to who is going to be uh, in the executive committee of Douglas Monzora's MDCT. Uh, we, we have said it already that Monzora is not contested, which means the presidium uh, is, um, is sorted out, the chairmanship is sorted out, and uh, they look forward to see who is going to be the new secretary general and uh, other NEC uh, members. So this is what is happening to Zimbabwe. It is what it is. That is Douglas Monzora for you. And um, we watch to see what is going to happen in the year 2023 because they are facing harmonized elections and um, it will be one of the uh, key contenders. That is uh, President Emerson Nangagwa, Nelson Chamisa, as well as Douglas Monzora. These are the three. Uh, contestants who are going to to to, to have uh, votes in 2023, but uh, we don't know if Douglas Monzora is going to to win because he always speaks about um, winning with 66 percent. But if if, if you see uh, 4,500 mm -hmm. delegates expected, then you have 1,000 uh, arriving. That is a sign that uh, indeed uh, Douglas Monzora's support is uh, dwindling and um, uh, Douglas Monzora is finished and we looked forward to see how he's going to revive himself but uh, this is a failed uh, opposition.